A jury today sentenced former Fort Worth police officer Aaron Dean to more than 11 years in prison for the 2019 shooting death of Tatiana Jefferson. Hello, I'm Steve Eager. The full sentence is 11 years, 10 months, and 12 days behind bars. 10 months and 12 days mirrors the date Jefferson was shot and killed October 12th. A jury reached the unanimous decision after a day and a half of deliberations. Fox Force Alex Boyer is live inside the Tarrant County Courthouse with the details. Alex. Stephen, you know, this uh, jury really took their time determining what they felt was an appropriate sentence for Aaron Dean. And in the end, as you just mentioned, they landed on 11 years, 10 months, and 12 days. And Jefferson supporters uh, can't help but think that the uh, sentence itself, remember that uh, Jefferson uh, was killed on October 12th, uh, they believe that that was in part a symbolic gesture on behalf of the jury. Now, this jury, which convicted Dean of manslaughter last week deliberated his punishment for over 12 hours over a two-day period. Now, during that time, the jury asked to re-watch Dean's body camera video from the night of the shooting. They also asked to read the Fort Worth Police Department's general orders, which dictates an officer's standard operating procedure. Family and friends of Jefferson began to get worried. The jury might not be able to reach a unanimous decision on sentencing, but just after 2 p.m., the sentence was handed handed down immediately after Jefferson's cousin took the stand to deliver an emotional victim impact statement. A Tatiana Jefferson was a bright, vibrant light. See, Aaron Dean, what you thought when you shot our baby through her heart, was that you were gonna put her light out. <laughs> That's what you thought. But I'm here to tell you that a Tatiana was that light that refuses to die. So what I'm saying is, <laughs> Aaron Dean, you ain't stop nothing. You ain't stop nothing. And after victim impact statements were over, Dean was ordered taken into the custody of the sheriff. It's been just over three years since Jefferson was shot dead inside her family's uh, Fort Worth home. You'll recall the reason Dean responded to the house in the first place is because Jefferson's neighbor called the non-emergency number to report the door was wide open. That neighbor, James Smith, was in the courtroom when that sentence was handed down. And the verdict, although not sufficient for me, I talk to them this death will be a catalyst for change of policing in Fort Worth, Texas. I'm still processing it, but the max is what I was looking for, but we're satisfied with the verdict. Dean's family was in the courtroom when the verdict was read, but did not make any statements to reporters afterwards. Now, Dean was not granted an appeal bond. It is very likely, of course, that the defense team will appeal this case, but he will remain in jail behind bars during that process as it plays out. Now, as it stands, Dean will have to serve at least five and a half years before he would be eligible for parole.